Hello, welcome back to my channel here. This is Penguin Tech. Today I'm going to have, show you a quick overview of the notebook I have here. This is the HP Elite Book 840G7 here. Let's start from the exterior. So as you can see, there is a HP logo here. This notebook is very thin and very light. And on here we have the power connector, HDMI output, uh, two Thunderbolt, USB-C and I'm not sure what this is could be a reset button but if anybody knows let me know down in the comments below nothing here and then on, on the left side we have the smart card reader two USB 3 and headphone and microphone combo jack as well as Kensington lock and also nothing here aside from the Elite Book logo here so the entire body, as far as I am concerned, is made of aluminium except for this piece of plastic here. This does sound like just plastic. And we have two long rubber feet here, one here and here. And here, and here are some grills for the fan to, in, to take in air. And I guess to open this laptop you have to unscrew all these screws here. So we have around one, two, three, four, five, visible, maybe some hidden under the sticker, or here. So this laptop has a 53 watt battery, if I'm not mistaken, and HP says that this battery should last more than 10 hours. It is also very light at 1.34 kg, so it makes it very portable. There's also a 1.44 kg version, and here is its power brick here. So it's a 65 watt power brick and here is the connector itself. So without further ado, let's take a look inside when you open up the laptop. So as you can see, you can open up this laptop with one hand. So this laptop has a window hello support and we have the webcam HD here. And there's also a privacy thing here that lets you slide open for your, for your webcam and also slide close the webcam and also what if you're using your webcam there's an LED indicator he, right here so as you can see the bezel is very thin um, I'll show you the bezel once I turn on the laptop and so as you can see here is the chiclet keyboard here it is very nice to type on the sensation is good and it has bang and evolution speakers here on both sides here which sounds very clear and good there's also your mouse pad here you can also click on the bottom of it there's also key on top of it and here you can see there's a small nipple here so this laptop comes with a 14 inch full HD IPS display that has accurate um, color so right now I'm turning it on so it's very secure, protected by HP Sure Start. See my spec here is the Core i5. It actually comes with i5 10th generation 103210. Here you can see there's a sort of fingerprint for you to log in and log out, which is a secure way. So my spec here is i5 10310U CPU that starts at 1.7 GHz. It also sports 16 GB RAM. And as you can see the keyboard layout here, the left and right button is bigger while the up and down button is smaller and the power button is hidden in, inside the keypad and here is the screen itself which looks very nice and as you can see the bezel is very small only the top and the bottom are, are larger as you can see it, it works very fast everything looks very fast and good and the system is very responsive Okay, it's a test.
lesson you learn from your journey in Haywood? There are nations where humans cast their god aside and stride forward. So are we to just abandon the notion of progress for the sake of wishful thinking? You and I have both witnessed the great loss that progress can bring. Eternity. Eternity is the only way. When lightning flashes, it casts a shadow. My name means shadow. So aside from that, um, there's also a short function keys here, and this key box comes with three, a few levels of backlighting. So I'm under the light now, so you don't see, but there is a white lighting under this keyboard. So that's about it, guys. This is my impression on on this HP EliteBook 840G7, a very nice laptop for uh working. So yeah, that's about it, guys. If you have any questions, leave it down comment down below here, and I'll try to respond them. And I'll see you guys next time. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe and share if you find this video useful. Thank you and goodbye.